Okay, hello folks. Welcome to another Odd Artworks. Normally where I take a blank page and turn it into a weird, funny, odd, surreal, strange, sometimes dark piece of artwork. Um, today I'm going to talk about something a little bit different, which is kind of projects that I would like to do. And I've got a, a number of things to show you here um, to sort of talk about where my head's at with these sorts of projects. So I'm going to talk to you about small press books. And I first started making small press books when I began as an illustrator, trying to hustle for work. And back then, in the olden days of the early to mid 2000s, used to, I used to, and a lot of illustrators used to, used to send out copy sheets, which are these sheets with your couple of few examples of your work, your contact details, which I've redacted for you lot, because you don't really need them. Um, and that's how I used to try and get work and I sort of, you know, send, used to send a load out and some I'd get responses from, some I'd get work from. Um, but after a while I kind of thought, right, I need, to, I need to stand out a little bit. And I'd always sort of made these little books that tell stories. And so I began making these, these little books, you know, about these funny characters. So I'd, I'd take a popular horror movie character, such as a zombie. And so my idea was very simple to sort of make the images show something from a horror movie and have the text to talk about something a bit more down to earth. So in this case, kind of a stroppy teenager going out to a, a mall or a shopping center to spend time with their friends of a weekend. So the images show a zombie on a bit of a rampage. having a good time. You know, and the images are very simple. They're just simple pen and ink drawings. Um, and I just made them into these little books. Um, so I used to send these off with my copy sheets to publishers. Um, and at the very least, they used to remember me. Um, and one or two were interested and, you know, I sort of followed that up with a few more things. Um, but, uh, yeah, uh, around about the time I started as an illustrator, I was very lucky, I was an artist in residence in a gallery and uh, at the time I was sort of encouraged to look for other gallery work for when I, I finished. And so I sort of started sending examples of my work off and these little books I sent off with them and quite often they'd say, yeah, we quite like your work, we haven't got any exhibitions, but if you want you can sell, our, sell your books in your gift shop. And uh, so I did. Uh, and they'd do quite well and then they'd suddenly say, Oh, well, your work sells quite well. Do you want to do a show? And I got into a lot of galleries through these funny little books, <laughs> which is quite good. So again, you know, it's character based, it's quirky, it sort of ticks all my boxes. So I'm kind of, why am I showing you these? Um, because I think I'm going to do a project. I think I'm, I haven't made one of these for a number of years. And I think at one point I had about 12 different ones. Um, so I think that's what's next, actually. So a bit of a shorter video this week, you know, just talking about future projects. So a little small press book. Um, so as always, folks, you know, let me know what you think. Do you, do you want to see more small press books? You know, maybe I'll do a limited crowdfunding campaign to, to get a couple of them off, off the ground. Or do you want to see these books collected into a larger book? You know, like I said, there's about 12 different ones of these little horror movie characters. Um, or do you want to see more of those? Just let me know. You know, I'm curious. Um, as always, folks, if you like the video, give it a like. Uh, and if you want to see more videos or give suggestions, things like that, please subscribe to the channel for more. Okay, folks, on that note, just finish showing you the end of this book. Uh, we'll call it a day there, and I will see you next time. So, Take it easy, folks. Bye now.